Welcome back to another 3D Insider video. Today we are talking about the best drones you could buy under $500 right now. So the first drone is the DJI Spark. This drone comes at a price of $399 has a 16 minute flight time and can go up to speeds of 31 miles per hour. It also has a two axis camera, which we'll get into shortly. Use hand gestures to control your moments, such as palm launch, palm control, away and follow, selfie and record. So the DJI Spark has a high performance camera, offering amazing images and stabilized videos. Starting off with a mechanical gimbal, a two axis giving you stabilized footage at 1080p. Since the Spark is small and compact, Spark's cameras features a 1 2.3 inch sensor, allowing you to shoot stabilized video at 1080p and still images at 12 megapixels. DJI Spark has also an amazing flight safety system. This system involves the main camera, the vision positioning system, which is the VPS, a 3D sensing system. These systems work together to allow the Spark to accurately fly anywhere up to 98 feet and sense obstacles up to 16 feet away and land safely. The DJI GO 4 app offers many capabilities and modes, including the system status, obstacle detection status, the battery level, the flight mode, diagnostics, video and photo capabilities, intelligent flight mode, and don't forget, you can edit and stream your footage right away on the DJI GO app also. And many more, so make sure you get the DJI app. Another drone we had in mind was the DJI Phantom 3. This drone is $499, its flight time is 25 minutes, and it has a 36 mile per hour speed. It also has a camera on the bottom, which we'll be getting into soon. The DJI Phantom 3 standard is not only liked just because of its good flight time or flight speed, mainly because of its beginner status and its excellent value for money. So here is the DJI GO app, the perfect app for beginners. This easy to use app comes with a few of the best intelligent flight control features such as follow me and point of interest. Live HD video streams straight to your device at hand. The GO app also allows you to adjust camera settings immediately and also has a stat control setting. This app also has an exclusive editing program which makes it easy to briefly edit your photos and videos. So let's talk a little bit about the camera on the DJI Phantom 3 standard. It has a sensor of a 1 2.3 inch and it has an image size by 4000 by 3000 and it's still photography modes is a single shot, first shot and a time lapse. So for video recording modes on the DJI Phantom 3, it shoots at a 2.7K, 1520p, 24 up to 30 frames per second, and a whopping 1080p, 24 to 30 frames per second also, and also shoots a 720p at 24 up to 60 frames per second. The image format is either JPEG or RAW, and its video format is MP4 or MOVE. A couple additional specs that we may have missed was its charging time is 60 minutes and its control range is 100 meters or approximately 3200 feet. Now stay tuned and watch some of the footage here.
So the last drone on our list is the Parrot Bebot 2 at $318 with a 24 minute flight time and a 36 mile per hour max speed and it has a 1080p camera. Within the Parrot Bebop 2, this drone doesn't come with its own controller. You need to fly it using your smartphone with the flight app. With its durable design and fast and stable design, it's easily portable and it's a great beginner drone for everyone. This drone shoots full HD 1080p video and takes 14 megapixel still photos. It has a 180 degree fisheye lens, which helps with it making a very nice and clean look as you can see on the screen. This drone also has a follow you feature, which means it follows you or whatever the subject may be and film you. This is one of the cheapest drones to have this kind of technology in it. A couple additional specs on this product is its charging time takes about 55 minutes and its control range is 300 meters. So just roughly 1000 feet. So with the Bebop 2, which comes about $300 with its affordable price. It comes with a few great features such as the camera, 1080p 14 megapixels, its max speed is 36 miles per hour, and its flight time is 24 minutes. It also comes with a few downsides such as its limited range, its limited 8 gigabyte memory SD card, and also the app costs money to unlock. Thank you for watching if you liked it make sure you put a big big thumbs up on the video and also if you are looking for any of these drones go down and into the description we'll link all of them right there and all the information will be laid out just below and also if you have any comments questions or concerns make sure you put them in the comment section below we try our best to respond to those as soon as possible i'll see you in the next one